Oh, hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the vlog. If you're new to the channel, I'm Steve Chapman of Fishing Florida Radio, and today is day four of iCast. What starts Monday is now, it's now Thursday. We've had the cup, we've had the new product showcase, we had a day of running around with our heads cut off, checking out new stuff. But today I'll go around and try to get some of the products that I think y'all might want to see. And the list is kind of big. This is page one of two. See the other page, my little logo. So, uh, we're gonna go around, check out some new stuff, take a bunch of still photos for the Instagram page, and that's Instagram slash fishing FL radio. So we're gonna do all sorts of things like that, and we have a dinner planned, and it's just, you try to take a deep breath right now because it's it's more than halfway finished. And of all things, you've seen me in this car a million times, maybe not a million times, except lots of times. This is one of the first times you will see that I don't have a fishing rod in the car, and that makes me upset. I always carry a fishing pole with me. In fact, I have an idea for a fishing episode after this is done in a stocked pond in front of the convention center. Anyway, make sure you hit that subscribe button, click that notification button, send us a like, click that like button, send us a comment. We'll try to reply to all of them. And uh, I gotta drive, I'm getting a late jump on it. But I thought I'd do the intro here and hopefully not get hit by another bus. Yeah, I got hit by a bus yesterday, in the car. So, iCast, day four. Day four, day quattro, as the people down south say. Let's do it. My name's Ethan Butler, I'm here at iCast 2019 with Arbogast, and I'm here talking about the Hoop Hopper 2.0. This is a brand new bag we've bought this year. Uh, really what the idea of this was was to bring up a modernized uh, design to the hoop hopper. So you know the hoop hopper's basically been unchanged since about the 1940s when it was introduced. And uh, what we've done, we've not only added new colors to the bait, so we've got these crackleback designs on here to kind of spruce the bait up a little bit, but we've also upgraded the hardware on it. So as opposed to the rubber skirt on the back like you've seen in the traditional hoop hoppers, we've now got this rear feather treble hook on there. Um, also the hooks on the bottom of there you can see there's a split ring so your hooks are going to be free swinging now and the hooks are now black nickel treble hooks as well so uh, the hookup ratio will go up and not only be able to hook more fish but also land more fish as well so brand how new many, hula popper. How many colors? Four new colors we're looking at some color extensions too pending the release goes well this year um, but yeah we're super excited about this bay so guys go pick some up. It's like eight bucks or nine bucks isn't it? Seven ninety nine. Yep. When are they going to be available? Uh, so they're releasing in Mystery Tackle Box. Mystery Tackle Box will have the exclusive release this year, this month in the July box. And I said that one. You do? I do. Sweet. <laughs> um, but yeah, this should be coming to retail shortly after. So I'd say about mid-July to early August. Awesome. Thank so, you. No problem, guys. W uh, website to find them? More uh, information? Yes, LureNet.com. 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 Thank you. No problem. Hey guys, Matt here in Bassmaster Elite Series Pro, coming to you from the 2019 iCast show. Hey, word's been out about a month about this bait. This is my baby, Reaction Innovation Spicy Beaver. You know, this bait for the last month's been the hottest bait on the market. You know, it's a great same style beaver body that everybody's fell in love with. It's right profile of everything bass feed on. We had a couple key features. We had a hook hanger on here for all the new straight shank style flipping hooks. It holds it, keeps the bait, the hook locked in place. And then, you know, there's, there's a few subtle features in here that we really, really worked on. Most of these baits, as they fall, they want to spread out and get really wide and when they try to swim. We wanted a bait that kind of stayed more compact and more subtle. And this bait as it falls, it likes to stay together. As a swim jig trailer, flipping jig trailer, casting jig trailer, this thing will work as a horny toad, you name it. This is an absolutely, a tremendously versatile bait. Check it out at your local dealer, Reaction Innovation Spicy Beef. How many colors are coming? 
right now 14 colors are available and we're adding colors on the next run so soon they'll be available in every great color that reaction innovations makes did you were you using them up there in the last tournament finished fifth at, uh, that's what i was Gunners about to ask the last tournament i sure did flipping this thing with a three-quarter ounce weight it uh i caught them this year at hartwell on it i've caught them this year at lake fork on it this bait has been a key player in my entire 2019 season, and I'm presently in the top 10 AOI points. That ought to tell you it's working pretty good. Awesome, thank you. Thank you, buddy. Hey guys, Brandon Ware here with BioBait. I uh, want to talk to you a little bit about our company and let you know what we got this year at ICAST. Um, basically, BioBait is a water-soluble bait. Um, we've taken the plastics out of plastic baits and we've replaced it with a plant compound which makes our baits water soluble so if you lose a bait in the water it'll eventually degrade over time it takes a little bit over a year however it keeps our fisheries safe and our fishes healthier so what I wanted to show you is our DNA line as you can see the detail in our DNA is what it is what the name explains DNA if it looks like a fish it smells like a fish and it swims like a fish fish are going to want to eat it now our baits are infused with fish oil they'll never dry out because they're built into the bait the longer you leave the bait outside of the water the more oil will come out of that bait over here we have our original bio bait bio bait's been around for about two years now now we are an american company our birthday is on july 4th so Make sure you guys stop by biobait.com to see what we have to offer. How much is how much is like the DNA pack? So a DNA pack is I'll go over here. Sorry. No, that's all right. So a DNA pack uh, is $7.99 retail. Uh, you can find them in a lot of the retail shops across the nation, also at biobait.com. Um, and then our original biobait over here uh, is selling for $5.99. So it's very comparable. Um, to the other soft plastics out there. However, you're gonna get a stronger bait because it's not plastic. Now, what is the scent that you guys, is there a formula you use for the scent or is it? So our scent is fish oil. Okay. Um, basically, you know, we don't want any of the, uh, the gimmicky stuff. And the reason I say that is because fish eat fish. And if it smells like a fish, they're going to be more attracted to it. So with our formula, what we found is that um, do, during our tests, that the fish oil is the best attractant to catch other fish. So again, biobait.com? Biobait.com. Thank you. Oh, oh, my name is Nadim. I'm working for Animated Lure. So Animated Lure is basically a robotic swim bait that uh, swims on its own, okay? So completely battery powered and you can charge it. So let me give you a little demonstration here. You take it out of the water. See, no on or off switch. Just like that, you have a bobber on one end, fully submerged underwater. And then after 12 seconds, it'll automatically start swimming. So this is kind of a demonstration of how, it, how it'll look when it's charging. You get a power bank, USB powered. Uh, you get the alligator clips, red on top, black on bottom. And as you can see here, our mini is already starting to swim. So that's the classic I just demonstrated. And then here, actually, we have a new saltwater brand here. So just like that, this is our Atlantic herring. Uh, power, more powerful, more efficient, longer lasting battery. And this one's a little more intuitive. So instead of the alligator clips, all you got here is your little magnetic clip to charge it. So USB powered, you can plug it into your, you know, whatever, a power bank or wall outlet. And that's it. So you have to use a bobber with it? Uh, we recommend using a bobber, yes, because otherwise it'll just dive down and keep swimming down. Okay. So you got a bobber on there, it'll kind of control it, it dives down. Uh, mimics lifelike patterns of a real fish, so kind of replaces your live bait. How long will the battery last? Uh, battery lasts for about, for, for the mini, it goes for about 45 minutes to an hour. Okay. And then for our classic that I showed you earlier, that'll go for about an hour to an hour and a half. Now treble hooks on the bottom, what kind yes. of hooks? Yes sir, I we got treble hooks. I don't even hooks, see so it. Let me show you the package. So for those of us uh, Florida natives, we got our golden shiner yes. here. So that'll come, this is the packaging here. So it'll have the two treble hooks on the bottom. It'll come with a propeller on it and a spare propeller. And you got your USB charging unit in there. A propeller? I didn't even see the propeller. Yeah, so propeller, that's what mobilizes it. Oh, okay. Yeah. How much are they gonna cost? So right now MSRP, you got an ICAST special going on till the end of July. Uh, the Classic and the Mini for $39.95. And then our salt water here for $79.95. If they want more information, where do they go? 
Uh, more information, animatedlure.com. Thank you. Yes, sir. Hey, what's up, guys? It's Brandon here with Salmo, Media Marketing Manager. Uh, we're here at iCast 2019, excited to show you all of our new products that we have coming out for the bass side. Uh, so starting off, we want to show you the new Salmo replicants. Uh, these are super, super realistic, soft plastic uh, rig swim baits. As you can see by looking at the patterns here, I mean, you can't get more realistic than this. The profile is perfect. The patterns are perfect. Uh, it's got a great swimming tail. Uh, top hook on the top for both the replicant bass and the replicant shad that we have right here. Uh, and then on the bottom, what's super unique about these is we actually have a swivel system here. We call it the belly hook rotation system. So when you have a big fish hooked up and when he, if, you know, if he turns and tries to shake that lure, that hook can completely turn here so you never lose pressure on that hook. So you don't get a bad angle, it's going to help you stay hooked. Uh, so in these replicants, we have the bass model here, we've got the shad model. And then we also have a bluegill. Uh, so Which three, I just love. So three popular, you know, predator forage species. Uh, everybody knows that bass feed on shad, bass feed on bluegill, and big bass even feed on other bass or even bass fry. Uh, so these are fantastic new baits, great swimming action. They skip really well, skip them under docks, you know, stuff like that. But great new lures, take the treble off if you want to fish them shallower too. Now over here, we're gonna show you some of our new bass hard baits. Well, let me ask a question. Sorry okay, to interrupt. Yeah, no problem. When are those going to be available? So the new Salmo replicants are going to be available next year, 2020, early, earlier in the year. So probably February, March, when we're going to start getting those out. You're going to be able to find them, you know, on the, the large online bass tackle shops. Uh, you'll be able to find them in other other online or other big retailers as well. Now, how much are they going to retail for too? The large size replicants are going to retail for $10.99. The smaller size, $9.99. Now I should mention. Those look like they were hard baits. They are plastic baits. They are soft plastic baits. So they are soft plastic. Baits. Yeah, soft plastic baits. They are extremely durable. They're going to hold up. You know, you'll be able to catch a ton of fish on it. It's going to come back for more. You'll still be able to keep using it. Uh, so yeah, those are soft baits. Now we're over onto the hard baits yes. here. So also new for uh, new here at iCast is the Salmo Rattle and Pop. This is a fantastic uh, popper. It's you know, we've basically tried to take everything that's great from classic poppers, but implement some new world technology. So it's got loud rattling system in there. There's a long casting system, so you can really, you know, really get it out there far. Uh, you can fish it like a traditional popper, or you can walk it as well. It's got a feathered tail there that gives you more drag, so you got more drag in the water, and just some beautifully finished patterns. Uh, the thing with all of our hard baits, every single one of these, they're all handcrafted. They're all painted by hand, assembled by hand. Uh, and every single one of these lures is tested in a tank of water to make sure that they're running right and they're tuned before they go into the box. So they are all going, going to run true for you straight out of the package and that's the Salmo guarantee. Uh, so this is uh, a fantastic, like I said, fantastic new top water lure for bass fishing. Really excited about. And then we're also adding another top water, water lure at the same time, which is the Salmo rattle and stick. So this is more of your walk the dog style bait. Uh, we had a lot of implement from our, you know, our professional anglers, uh, anglers on the FLW Tour and the Bass Series and other series, uh, you know, and they wanted a walk the dog style bait, but with a really deep rattle. So if you hear this, this is a much deeper rattle than you traditionally hear in, in you know, hard baits. And uh, that big weight in there that's making that rattle really allows you to bomb this lure out there too. This is the furthest lure that I, or, you know, the lure, out of all the lures that I know, you can cast this thing the furthest. But great top water walk the dog bait if you fish it on a slow retrieve you can get more wider walk with it and if you fish it on a faster retrieve you get that faster walk so you can cover you know cover water faster whichever way you're finding the fish are biting uh, that's a great lure and so those are all of our new lures that we have here at iCast from Salmo uh, for bass fishing so please check them out like I said these will all be available 2020 next year uh, they're just handcrafted works of art. You check them out, you see the patterns on them, you know that these are all the real deal. There's no gimmicks with us, we do everything right. So you can check them out, SalmoUSA.com, and thanks for tuning in. Hey guys, we're here at the ICAST 2019. We're working the Livingston booth. We got the new Walking Boss Junior. It's three and a half inches long. It uh, retails at $9.49. It'll be available in December 2019. There'll be eight colors available and probably more in the future to come. Thanks. Have you, 
Have you guys used it yet together? Have you guys thrown it? Yeah, we test it a lot, especially in the waters in Florida, so they work that's, out. That's me. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna be you. You like snooks, that kind of stuff? Is oh yeah, oh yeah, perfect. Yeah, I got it for a living down in Florida, so, okay. you know, that's what I use for it. That's what it is. Have you? I've used it, smallmouth, love it. Uh, spotted bass, love it. Largemouth, they all love it. I'm from a lake that don't have very large bait, so the walking boss one is a larger one of this. They don't really work all that well. But this right here works wonders in a smaller forge lake. The Walking Boss Junior, you know, Livingston's known for the EBS technology. It does come with EBS. Um, it has contact points on the hook eyelets, and you can actually hear it. You might be able to hear it in this video. It's a little loud in here. But it does come with that. I think it has three sounds. Three sounds. Three different sounds. You, uh, and you can do a different video. To get the sounds, what you'll do is you just hold it, find the sound you want, and then release it whenever you get the sound you want, and it'll stick to that sound. Oh, no kidding. I didn't know that. You know now. Now you know. <laughs> the more you know, the better. <laughs>